Cancer is still a major global health issue with a very spotty cure success rate. Chemotherapy and radiation are effective in certain cases, but never without side effects. All cellular behavior includes electrical, chemical, and mechanical processes. However, the pharmaceutical industry focuses only on chemical-based cures. This limited focus has resulted in a small fraction of the potential therapies that can be created from a broader understanding of bioactive electrical signals. The patented Live Cell Viability Modification System, or LCVMS for short, is designed to eavesdrop on and learn the natural electrical language of cancer cells and also kill cancer cells using electrical signals from their own language as well as other very specific electrical signals drawn from the electromagnetic spectrum. By understanding the natural language cancer cells use to communicate with other cells, neighboring tissue, and the immune system, we can discover the answer to cancer. Medtronic has invested in an array of companies that electrically lower blood pressure, eliminate migraine headaches, and positively affect Alzheimer's issues. Novocure has received over $200 million to develop its non-invasive electromagnetic glioblastoma brain cancer treatment device, which has recently received FDA approval for use in the USA, having proven to be as effective as chemo without side effects. Here is a culture dish where we have grown a population of prostate cancer cells. We lower the cell signal sensing electrode into the dish to make contact with the cells. Above the electrode are the energy radiating coils. You can see on the screen that the cells are thriving and there are very few rounded up dead cells. That is going to change very shortly. Here we see typical electrical signals representing cancer cell metabolic activity. We trigger a specific signal that immediately causes the cells to overload their activity with dramatic negative pulses. A second signal clamps the cell's energy to a fraction of normal amplitude. You now see a significant increase in dead, rounded up cells. This is the molecular analysis package we still need to add to the system. It uses broadband infrared absorption spectroscopy to display the molecular difference between treated and untreated cells. The right-hand images are untreated, left are treated. It is very easy to see the significant changes at the molecular level following the electrical signal application. Understanding the manner in which cells communicate at the electrical and molecular levels will provide a broad menu of unique electrical signals and provide inexpensive cancer cure tools. I'm Howard Latovsky, creator of the LCVMS. You can feel free to contact me anytime at 707-481-5252 or email me at mail at howardlatovsky.com. You can also look up the patents at uspto.gov. Call me anytime with any questions and I'll be happy to answer them. Thanks a lot.